gentlemen, this is the testing area for Piggy. That's right, if you know nothing about Piggy, then let me just explain it to you. You are trapped in a house full of puzzles. You must complete those puzzles to escape the house, but you can't get caught by the infected Piggy. And this is the place that they create the infected. That's right, and there is actually a couple of characters that they have actually added here. <laughs> he looks so dumb. And they also added this elephant. Anyway, I thought that we would log on and see what other characters they have created. And guys, there's a ton of them. And the last one is insane. That's right, and you can help me by liking this video. That's right, each one like equals one character that they will add into this game. At 5,000 likes, I'll upload another piggy video. Also, whilst you're at it, subscribe down below. Let's do this. Okay, so the first character we're going to be checking out today is the one and only Mandy Mouse. That's right, we're not only going to be checking out these characters, but I'm also going to be giving you a bit of backstory too. That's right, guys. <laughs> At least as much as I know of the backstory. <laughs> so as you guys can see right now, this is a Mandy Mouse, and it says that she has to be anchored because she is always escaping. <laughs> okay, I just want to say one more thing before I continue to showcase these characters. There is one character inside of this entire showcase that literally gives me the heebie-jeebie, guys, and I will be showing you that character at the end of this video. But trust me, you don't want to miss some of the characters we will be seeing in between on this video because some of them are actually really, really cool designs and actually incredibly creepy. I don't know. Anyway, let's get back to the characters. So our first two that we're going to be showcasing, guys, are kind of irrelevant now. And the reason that I think that, guys, is that Mandy Mouse and the second person we're going to be looking at are both hospital-themed. And as many of you know, the chapter has already been and gone already. That's right, chapter six is based in a hospital with an infected patient, which I think might be Mr. P's wife, by the way. So the reason that I think that this may be a hospital patient is because, well, A, it's in a wheelchair, and B, it kind of looks like it's wearing a hospital gown. And so I'm guessing this character was created for chapter 6, but unfortunately wasn't used. So, uh, yeah, I'm gonna use my keycard right now to let Mandy Mouse out. Oh, yeah, I forgot. She's, uh, she's anchored. <laughs> she's not coming out. Okay, well, guys, I literally have to get myself killed by Mandy Mouse right now. So here we go, guys. In 3, 2, 1, Mandy! Wait, what? Ooh. Oh! <laughs> That was the worst death ever. That's right, guys. The second person that we're going to be looking at today is another hospital-themed character. So let's take a look at them straight away. And as you can see, it's Mrs. Cow. Aww. That's right, guys. She might look super cute, but you get too close and she will kill you. So literally, if I come a little bit closer to Mrs. Cow right now, she should turn around and we'll get a good look at her. And as you guys can see, I'm guessing again, like the first person, Mandy, I think that she was designed to be used in the hospital. As you can see, she has like these giant scary injection things. Yep. <laughs> Absolutely terrifying. But yeah, as you can see, she's a nurse. So I have my own theory on this right now, guys. Mrs. Cow could be one of two things. So my first theory is incredibly simple. I think that she could be working with Mrs. Mr. P, because if you guys remember in the circus, if you looked inside of Foxy's cage, Foxy clearly said that his friends did this to him. And I'm thinking that Mrs. Cow could be one of the friends that administers the cure. Hence why she has these giant, terrifying, uh... Needles. And my other theory, guys, is that actually she's doing the complete opposite and she's just trying to help by giving people the cure. Boring, I know. Anyway, guys, it's time for me to let Mrs. Cow out right now. And I'm not gonna lie, I'm kind of scared. Ah! She injected me with... Either the cure or the infected. Okay, so the third character that we're going to be looking at is actually a really cool one chosen by you guys, apparently. And they are standing in front of me right now. In fact, wait a minute. Ah! She is literally staring right at me. Anyway, I feel like the design is going the right direction right now. Look how amazing this character is. I'm not sure how they're gonna add Kylie Kangaroo. And I'm also not sure if this is part of the Peppa Pig series. Guys, I mean, this is gonna kind of make Piggy a bit less PG than it is. Having spinning, attacking blades. Yeah, well, <laughs> I'm pretty scared of this character, guys. Again, there's not really a backstory to Kylie Kangaroo. But uh, she's gonna give us a pretty good jump scare right now. So here we go. Let's open the cage and let's see what she looks like chasing us. Oh, when they stand on here, guys, they go so fast. Look. Oh, my goodness. That is so terrifying. Anyway, it's time for us to die right now to Kylie. So take me down, Kylie. Let's see your animation. Whoa. 
Okay, so it looks like Kylie just holds the blade out in front of her and cuts you like a turkey. And that's right, now I have to join the game again. Otherwise, she won't go back in her cage. Okay, so guys, the next one again doesn't really have a backstory to it yet. So we're literally just gonna check this one out. And I hope this one doesn't just kill me randomly because I will be upset and I will fight back. Okay, so the next one we're looking at right now is a Molly Mole. As you can see, suggested by the most players, this, for some reason, is the one that you you all wanted to see. The shite, the killing animation of this one is pretty cool. I mean, it has a chainsaw and a pair of neon glasses on its face. So I, I guess that's one reason to uh, ask for this guy to be made. Also, is this character from the Peppa Pig series? Because I think there seems to be a, uh, a theme here. Okay, Molly Mole is actually a character from Peppa Pig. Wait a minute, does that mean the Kylie Kangaroo is too? <laughs> Okay, that's why you guys wanted these characters made. They are both characters from Peppa Pig. Oh my goodness, you guys are crazy. Okay, well guys, obviously I don't know anything about Peppa Pig, but what I do know is that you guys have had this thing created and it's absolutely terrifying. And right now, unfortunately for me, I, I have to die to Molly Moe. So Molly, if you could just stay back. Molly, if you could just stay back. Oh, okay, Molly has been freed. Oh, I hate it when we go on this bit. It literally scares me. Oh, oh, no, no. <laughs> she got me. Oh, my goodness, Molly. Okay, Molly. Molly, you've had your time, Molly. Can you please get back in your cage? Okay, so the next one we're going to be looking at right now is the character Mr. P. And obviously, you've seen Mr. P before in uh, one of the chapters where he was standing there underground in the sewer. But as you guys can see now, he is equipped with what seems to be a very peculiar looking potion. Guys, I actually can't believe they really created Mr. P. I mean, look at this guy. He has a mustache, a weird top hat. He's, he's pretty much the flattest potato I've ever seen. I mean, the P does stand for potato, right? But... One very important thing that they have done, guys, is they have created him using the potion in animation. Which leads me to believe that this character may actually be the one causing everybody to go infected. So I think it's time to release the beast from his cage. <laughs> oh my goodness. <gasps> Let's see if he uses his potion on me. He did! He used his potion! So ladies and gentlemen, it looks like everybody's theories are starting to add up slightly. And maybe, just maybe, Mr. P truly is the person causing everybody to become infected. We just looked at Mr. P, and now we're about to look at something brand new, and also something I was expecting. That's right, if any of you have played the circus chapter in Piggy, then you will know that in the end scene, there is a photo on the wall. And we have to assume that this room is the owner's office of the entire circus. And you know who owns that circus, guys? It's Mr. P. That's right, guys. What you're about to see, it probably won't surprise you much, but it's pretty cool. Ladies and gentlemen, I present you Mrs. P. That's right, guys. They actually added his daughter. Or is it his wife? <laughs> guys, they're making this so hard right now for us to figure out, okay? If you literally think about this right now, Mrs. P would mean that she's a Mrs. and she's married, all right? And if she's Mrs. P, then she's married to Mr. P. Meaning that this is not his daughter. This is his wife. Ah, uh, it's so confusing. Guys, I am never going to get to the bottom of this mystery. No, but I'm going to try my best to uncover it. <laughs> anyway, we're going to release her right now just like that and let's see what the animation looks like when she jump scares us here we go no oh, she just hit me with a flower pot guys that was really mean actually i didn't want to get hit with a flower pot today you know okay guys we're literally getting down to the last two characters and uh like i said the last one is gonna blow your mind but this next one uh, i'm really not too sure about this that's right when you look at this right now you're probably thinking what is that is that a parrot on his shoulder <laughs> It is! That's right, guys! This is Grandpa Piggy! And yes, he, he really wants to kill me right now. And again, guys, I'm really not too sure for the reason that they had to add him! Like, when they first added Grandma Piggy, I was super confused because if you followed the story, you will know that really Grandma and Grandpa Piggy aren't really involved in this. That's right, it was only three of the four main Piggy family, aka Peppa Pig, Mommy, and Daddy Pig, that were infected with the cure. Because George Pig didn't want to get involved, and so I'm really not too sure why they added grandma and grandma piggy unless Ooh, maybe guys they came around for a turkey dinner before they were fully infected and then they became infected then okay but i gotta be honest this is one of my favorites 
<laughs> oh, for some reason, his hat is falling off his head there. Oh, it's because it's a falling animation. Let's let Grandpa Piggy free, and hopefully he's as slow as he is old, because that way he can't catch me. <laughs> look at Grandpa Look at Grandpa Piggy. Come on, Grandpa. What, you going to stand on the treadmill all day? Okay, but seriously, we're going to check out this jump scare over here by the waterfall. So here we go. Let's, let's see what it looks like. Oh, he's coming. He's coming. And whoop. <laughs> oh, wait, I missed it. Oh, okay. I thought I got away, but it looks like he killed me anyway. Okay, well, guys, it looks like now it is finally time for number one on our countdown. Guys, I swear I just heard something. That was super weird. <gasps> oh, what is that thing? Oh, my goodness. Guys, I can't outrun it. It's too fast. No. <laughs> I'm just kidding. That's right, guys. Look at this. This is the coolest character they have even thought of adding to Piggy so far. Now, I have my own small backstory for this Piggy, but I gotta be honest, guys. It's incredibly slow. Like, you can outrun it so fast, it's not even funny. Okay, so guys, this is my theory. I reckon that they're gonna use this for some sort of boss fight in the final chapter of this game. Maybe whoever is creating these infected, horrible character monsters is going to create an ultimate boss monster. Uh, just like this one over here. <laughs> Wait, is he stuck over there? I knew this was gonna happen. I should have never freed him from that cage. Anyway, if they add this into the game, this would be like the most epic thing they could possibly do. I mean, think about it. I mean, they could literally put this guy in like a cool sewer area or maybe even like a dungeon. Either way, one is enough. Like seriously, I don't want any more of these guys. They're, they're way too powerful. The side, I also noticed they made a zoom map and I'm gonna try and glitch inside of there, guys and have a good look. If you wanna see that video, then leave a like down below. Below. And also, if you want to see any more of the characters showcased inside of this game, then also leave a like down below. But yes, guys, that is going to be it from me today. If you guys did enjoy this video, then please do hit the subscribe button. What are you waiting for? As you can see, there is two videos on the screen right now. This one will get you in your sleep if you don't click this one. It's that simple. Again, guys, thank you so much for watching, and I will see you all in the next video. Goodbye!